Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Banished. I'm your host, Caleb, and we're here in the year 30. As a, the summer harvest is about to come in. Yeah, there it is. Alright, so we're now getting in a nice harvest, which is good. Uh, we've kind of run in a little low on food. Uh, we don't really produce enough without the farm field anymore. But as you can see, our population is back to booming. Basically where it was before, except with uh, about 10 more adults. And uh, we're just down some fishermen, really. Which uh, I'll help out by tossing into the pool. Once the farmers are done, they can go back to fishing over the winter. It's always uh, important to try and keep. Very good. All right, we do have enough. We don't have enough tools, which seems to be a bit of a problem. And the reason we don't have enough tools seems to be we don't have enough wood, which. We also don't have enough firewood, so the root cause of all of our problems seems to be related to our lack of wood, which is really quite annoying because that means I have to have a lot of labor to collect a lot of wood, which I've been doing. I, I actually have been collecting a pile of wood whenever I can. Uh, equally so, I'm concerned about food. Well, that's the end of the season. Congratulations, you guys are on labor duty. Yeah, grab whatever you can. It wasn't a great harvest this season. Hopefully we'll be okay. Early early frost. You can just kill your crops, man. You really just can. And it sucks. Last season was pretty good. We got a full 100%. And the season before that, so... It's not too bad, I guess. Again, part of the problem, though, we uh, don't have enough firewood. So I'm hoping that uh, now that we have a bunch of laborers, that some stuff can work on that. As you can see, the town hall has been slowly coming together over time. Really slowly, but kind of okay-ish. I'm going to unpause this and, uh, well, there's one guy to build her. There we go. Just so, you know, some work gets done. People are going to haul materials here. You know, that's what the laborers do. We actually have, uh, quite a few. Lots of people are growing up. Which is good. We're going to need them. I really need to get the second farm field up, actually. I'm gonna unpause it and, uh... Actually up it to, uh, the full construction. I would... Like, it doesn't take much to construct this, it just requires the removal of some trees. So they're basically doing laboring work. That's alright. Just they're, they're removing very specific stuff. Because I'm hoping that uh, next season we can harvest a full two fields. Which uh, might help a little bit. The situation is a bit precarious still, but we're holding together. Okay, so he's freezing. No. We have coats, so there's that. And we also have a tool shortage. Again, caused by more or less the same thing. Uh, we have logs shortage, really. More than anything. Because the amount we're converting into firewood is insane. I wish, really wish we could convert less into firewood. Really can't, I mean. I've just pretty much cut down that entire island right there. To say the least, it was not good. Alright, 46. It's taking them so long. We're continually losing out on tools, and it's becoming a big problem. Like, I have no choice but to, like, just shut down some of the woodcutting facilities and start letting people freeze to death. I think it's the only thing I can do. As cruel as it may be, I suppose that's the sort of thing you have to do. I find there's just one person working on it at this point. Like, just so long as, you know, we get it done eventually. Not particularly a high priority, but it is now spring. Kind of like start plan, but well. we're not getting this this season because builders are lazy. Uh, they were fine finishing the town hall. I don't really care how long it takes to get that thing done. It really doesn't matter to me. I really want this field done, though. I don't know. Of course, half of our farmers don't have tools now. A lot of the iron went into the town hall, so that explains the iron. Things are being worked on. Like, 
Planting hasn't even finished yet, has it? No. The season's gonna be terrible. All because of, you know, fuel shortage. I don't really understand why. Like, no matter how much I cut down, we always seem to have wood shortage. No matter how much I mine, we always seem to have friggin' iron shortage. Nine laborers. I'm giving them the clear cut order on this stuff down here. Like it's it's required at this point. I cannot allow it to you know. I, I need the resources. I've already clear cut this whole island. The miners are going at it, we've got ten of them. Hundred and six out of hundred and sixty field points. I don't really know if nomads are gonna save us anymore. But I don't think they will. They're just gonna cause more of a problem than anything else. Like I said, the big problem seems to be we need two weeks. It's late summer. I have to begin the harvest now, or we're just not gonna get any. It's not worth it to, uh, you know, keep it like that. Uh, like, the harvest has to begin now, or else it's just gonna frost over. Probably still will lose some of it, but I'm hoping to minimize the losses. Especially considering a lot of our men don't have tools right now. Our farmers are out of that, out of that, I'm afraid. At least it seems like we're actually starting to get some work done with the tools. Yeah, it's, they're being produced. Hopefully this crisis will be solved now. Now that we have enough laborers. Put one guy on that, just in case something ever actually gets done. You never know. Yeah, this region's also been ordered for cutting, so I'm hoping that we can get that stuff together here. We don't have any firewood, so that's great. I'm actually five fishermen to try and make up for the uh, lack of food we're suffering from. Well, we'll be getting the farmers back soon. Yes, it's already autumn. It'll be hitting late autumn in no time. Luckily, we don't have quite such an early frost this time, but come late autumn, it'll most certainly be a frost. Or a non time frost, I'm sure. It's already one degree. It's not going to last long. Zero. Any lower, and we know what happened. Yep, there we go. Well, I think I made the right call when I started that harvest seems to have been the right way to do it. It's the right time to harvest. So we're 20 out of 20 fishermen. Um, reserve of food is terrible right now, as we expect. Basically back at the former state we were in, except and running out of tools equally so. And I can't figure out how to remedy this. Wood supply is okay. The real problem seems to just be iron. Which I guess we fix by putting more people in the mines. I think that's really the only thing I can think to do. Try and improve the production of iron. Improve the production of tools. And hopefully something works in that truly. I don't really care much for the coats. Although we have no firewood, which doesn't exactly help. Oh dear. I'm trying to solve this weird. It's kind of an enigma, and I'm not certain how to tackle it. Not certain how to tackle it. Oh, hey, the town hall's done. Good. So we get an extra laborer. Yeah, graphs. Nomads. Required to use those season livestock. No nomads are here. Inventory production. Yeah. Current yeah, use produced. Okay. 
So we're basically still having production problems, but at least the number of people with out news is dropping. And, uh, this is happening. Hopefully we'll, we'll ship a bunch of iron mines here. I'm going to pump up a couple more vendors here in the hopes that we can get a little more logistics done. But there's still a pile of iron sitting at the mines, for example. If we can do things like that, that would be great. Yeah, we can all that work together. The iron, bring it to, you know, somewhere. Turn it into tools. So that way we can solve the crisis. I hope. Still a fourth forester, so we should be getting at least a certain amount of logs. Oh yeah, it's spring. That field is slightly more clear. It's at 8 out of 14. It was at 7 out of 14 before. This is just generally where I pull about 5 people off the fishing docks. And Farm. Seems to be the best way. Well, I mean, there's no reason not to have the little filters at this point. If they can clear the field, great. If not, I don't know. Look at 28 people without tools. Again, like, we, we have enough here to make. Like, 30 years, like, 13 tools. Like, we're producing enough iron. <laughs> kind of. The problem seems to be it's just not being taken. What the hell? I was trying to saw a guy bring iron down there, drop it on the ground, and then walk away. Like, we're not seeing what he's actually carrying. But, like, I don't know. I'm not entirely certain how we can handle this. Tool prices just continue to get worse, and it's not because we don't have the blacksmiths, it's because the iron is moving out of the mine. More laborers, I guess. Laborers are the last sort of thing, I hope. I feel like yeah, there's just a lost cause at this point. And the bean farm's not even planted. Alright. Guess we don't get a crop this year. I'm not entirely sure as to why that occurred. Uh, apparently everyone just decided that was a you know, not a plant. Not a plant this year. I'm not certain what happened, but hopefully we'll survive. Hopefully the extra laborers means we can actually get some tools going now. We have eight laborers now. That is really my only hope. That they'll start hauling iron around. And we'll actually start making some goddamn tools. Like, we actually have enough wood, strangely enough. Um, now we just need more iron. Which we're actually getting now. Okay, come on. We need more people hauling the iron. Oh no. There's no, no food in that barn. I have as much food production as I can get right now. It would be harvest season and we might be okay if we could have you know, had both those farms working, but. Died of starvation. We now don't have enough food. Most of that's because we don't have enough tools, though. So, we're getting into the exact same death spiral as before. Except this time I'm trying to produce enough tools to get out of it. But, I don't know how long that's going to be for. Because it really seems like we uh, have problems with this. We need more laborers, I guess. It's, it seems to work. Cut the foresters to labor. We just need... Apparently there's enough jobs for laborers. We just don't have enough laborers. So no one's hauling the iron. This region has been cut down. It's instructed. I think I'm going to lay off on uh, this area. It's kind of valuable to regrow. Hopefully that'll direct more people to haul iron. 
Because, yeah, people are starving badly now. Everyone's just dropping dead of starvation. The laborers are just filling that place. But apparently, uh, it's not helping the tool situation as much as I hoped it would. People continue to die of starvation. And we now no longer have any laborers to replace. You'd be hoping that, uh, in this case, you know. Well, hopefully we can. I don't even know what happened to all of our iron. It just kind of vanished. Nothing but the uh, blacksmiths should be using iron. So, the problem seems to be we just don't have enough tools, and 10 people are now starting. Lovely. You're not going to be able to replace them. And we're pretty much at the minimum level that we can function at. Like, it's only downhill from here. No laborers able to replace anyone. More people continue to die of starvation. Now it's early spring, so okay, luck. What remains of the uh, task force here? We put in the farming, hoping that we have enough tools. We're down to one blacksmith, so cut them, cut them, put it into that. Farm like you've never farmed before, guys. The entire life and future of this settlement depends on you. I've been saying that way too often. And that's a problem. The child, children are dying of starvation. That's acceptable. They aren't real workers, so we can handle losing them. But it seems like there's a fundamental problem with how my town is designed or something. If it just can't produce enough tools. Despite having, you know... I feel like I need, like, surface iron to gather if I'm going to do that. But the mines just aren't fast enough. More people mining at the same time I need more people on food, and I can't have both. Okay, so the, all the fishermen are dead. Gatherers are now dying. Whatever we can get remaining as miners, I guess, is good. We need them. Use all the damn tools you can, guys. Come on. Tool shortage is continuing. Well, this is a shitty season for food. Which pretty much dooms us. Well, we only have 38 people. Like, I'm going to have to begin the uh, harvest very soon. Okay, this isn't too bad, it looks like. It's gotten fairly well planted. Good. This is not so much, though. The second it hits late summer, I have to begin the harvest. I don't have an option. not going to be great, but eh, at least one field's good. Alright, late summer. Begin the damn harvest. I don't know how long it'll be until I can harvest. There we go. Get the harvest started. For the love of all that is holy. I don't care where we have to pull it from, get as much harvested as we can. And keep those damn tools coming. Like I said, there's a ton of just iron sitting there that nobody can use apparently. Because specifically laborers have to haul it. I don't see the black like the blacksmiths aren't pulling iron from the mines. I don't really have the spare power to have laborers. It might be okay actually. 
fields both kind of got planted. Depends uh, how long it takes to go zero, I suppose. Tool shortage is going away. Foods are piling, foods piling into the houses. And there we are. It might be okay. But yeah, this is a vicious, vicious cycle, and I'm not certain how to break it. Like, I don't see any way of getting enough tools. Because there's not enough people hauling iron. I guess those blacksmiths are hauling iron. Yeah. I guess so. Uh, well, that's the end of the uh, harvest, I guess. It was alright. We managed to get some. I'll take what I can get. At least no one's dying of starvation anymore. So, there's that. The hunters have, and the gatherers have to go back to work, though. Before to continue. No laborers are available to replace anyone. No kidding. Still a tool shortage. Uh, no matter how many tools we make, people just seem to manage to break, which is silly. Like, we have 31 people. 21, only 21 of them can use tools. So the fact that we can't get enough tools for them is ridiculous. Yeah, well, whatever. Uh, so, we've seen another collapse. Another setback. I'm trying to think, like, how can I solve this tool problem? It seems as if though I just don't ever have enough laborers. I'll have to come up with something. So, it's gonna likely be another time skip as I figure it out. It will take time, as for to recover again, and hopefully nomads come by. That'll speed up the recovery. But we have managed to solve the uh, tool crisis. And now we just have no woodcutters, so people are gonna start freezing to death soon. We also still have no food, it seems, which, which is, even in my eyes, silly. Like, we should. Like, it, it seems silly that we have no, uh, no food right now. Like, we have eight gatherers, five hunters. That is a reasonably large amount of it. Like, that's over half the population. Well, close to half the population producing food. That should be enough. It's producing stuff. And yeah, people are freezing to death because we don't have any wood. I think, yeah, one of my woodcutters died. There. Best I can do. Now I'm gonna drop below five miners because we just need more tools. We need iron. More tools. The woodcutters have chopped our entire wood supply out. That's, that's, that's everything we have. Dear Lord. Huh, this is a deadly, deadly cycle. Well, I suppose I'll see you guys next time. As always, this has been your lovely host, Pielden, signing off.